You no, met the girl. I was not in her friend zone. Yes, you were. No, I wasn't. She said she saw you with a little brother. Oh! <laughs> Hey, what's up, Candle Metal Squad? You hey, gang. Today we got an episode of the debate game where we basically have two people. They have to debate a topic and we pick who the winner is. All right, so first up, we got Mike and his girlfriend, Joy. And they're going to be debating a topic that we think of. And the catch is they have to debate in Chinese only. How? Okay. Each time they speak English, they get hit with the orangutan of pain. <laughs> Yeah, this is actually kind of cute though. <laughs> okay, all right. So first up, Mike and Joyce, I, I just you guys. Very weird that you're gonna hit my girlfriend, mm. and not even in a nice way. I should hit her. Uh, no, I'm hitting her. Wait, <laughs> that's so weird. Why? Why would you say that on camera? That's, the, that's the rule. The judge hits. All right. Let's give him the first topic. No, all right. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm hitting her. You guys are gonna debate this, all right? Mike is a good boyfriend. Okay. <laughs> Joy has to argue against it, she has to disagree, and Mike has oh, to agree easy. and argue for it. Okay. Are there any English words you wanna look up in Chinese beforehand? First up, we'll have Mike arguing why he thinks he's a good boyfriend. Okay. Three, two, one, go. Well, you know, I'm a good boyfriend because I think I'm really, really love you. Do you know what I mean? The biggest thing is that every time you're hungry, I'll say, oh, let's go buy some food. Or if you're hungry, I'll help you get some water. And then if you're tired, I'll help you sleep. When you're the big boy, I'll help you get some food. And then I think I'm doing things when I do things, the first thing is to want you. Because you're hungry, 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 you're
Andy has publicly said that many times. Okay, oh, all right. Wow. Okay, let's, let's debate who, who's the winner. Is. The winner is Edward! <laughs> Sorry, man. Dude, dude. I, I, no, bro. You're gonna, you, you should have said something else, man. Your topic is gonna be the best way to break up is through text. Joy, you're arguing for it, and Edward, you're arguing against it. Texting is the best way to end a relationship. Edward disagrees. Let's hear his answer in three, two, one, go. Dianxin是一个不好的方法去做完一个感情,因为你跟一个人让了这么多时间,对吗? <laughs> <laughs> and all I gotta say is, yo, as a Cantonese speaker, you gotta up your Mandarin, bro. You gotta take the Canada Blueprint, dude. Which is our course for Cantonese speakers help, to help Cantonese speakers learn Mandarin. By the way, guys, real quick, I'm looking for a few Canto people to work closely with who want to learn Mandarin. Seriously, in six weeks, you can be speaking Mandarin. If that's you, DM me on Instagram. I want to learn Mando, and I'll see if I can help you out. Why is texting the ideal way to end a relationship in three, two, one? One go. That is a really that, yeah, good that, reason. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I actually, no, what? it's a good reason. She brought up in cases of domestic abuse, maybe yeah. the girl feels unsafe about doing it in person. No, she put a perspective that honestly, me as a strong buff male, <laughs> Have never, would never have experienced, honestly. I, I don't know you guys thought like this, okay? I would have said, like, you can get your stuff back in person. And then you'd be like, oh <laughs> shit, that's so lit. Three, two, two one, one go! Hey, Joy wins this week's debate challenge. Guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below what other topics you think would be fun for this challenge. Click here to watch a previous debate challenge video and click here to watch the video you think you'll love. Peace! <laughs>